one. Okay. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Roll call. Mr. DiCarlo? Here. Mr. King? Here. Mr. Conduct? Here. Mr. Molina? Here. Mr. Silverstone? Here. Mr. Walter? Here. <laughs> Approval minutes from October 22nd, 2013. Move to approve. Second. Roll call. King? Yes. Mr. Condit? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverstone? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DeCarlo? Yes. Acceptance of financial report from fiscal officer? Move to accept. Second. Second. Roll call. Mr. Condit? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverstone? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DeCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Any amendments to the agenda? We have resolution number 66 2013, a resolution to approve the recommendation of the Twinsburg Township Village of Reminderville Jed Board in regard to the 2014 Jed budget. Second. Roll call. <clears throat> Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverstone? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Mr. Condon? Yes. Any other comments from the public? 30 minutes maximum time, five minutes per person. Raise your hand, state your address. Any comments from the public? Hello, Walter Hoffman, 3755 Surfside Circle. I just wanted to thank uh, the board for their endorsement. I was not unable to be here, and it certainly made a difference, I think, in regards to the school levy and the consistent support that this council and the other councils that, support, uh, that feed into the school district have consistently given the schools and it is very very appreciate, appreciated and to the voters of course i say thank you um, it was an overwhelming uh, support that was shown the schools uh, about a two to one uh, victory uh, in all the communities not just reminderville and i think it speaks well of this community and how well they consistently do support the schools. So uh, thank you very, very much for everything you do to help us with that. Thank you. Thank you. Anybody else? I just, I just want to say real quick, um, thank you to, to Chief Buck and his folks and the Hoffmans and the Williams. <clears throat> Being at the Halloween party was, was great um, and having my three children <clears throat> it's wonderful, and I, you know, I wish I could help and do more, but I just want to let you guys know they all had a great time. And thank you for all that you, you do. It was a phenomenal, phenomenal event. Is that a comment from the public? Kind of. Yes. Say your address and name. It's for the no, public. Yeah. <laughs> I'm also part of the public, right? <laughs> right. Okay. Anybody else? No? Al Williams, 10589 Florida Street. For an off election, you had approximately 600 voters, which seemed quite heavy. We were shocked that it was a constant flow of people this time. Is that is that on all three precincts I total 600? Total okay, so I was wondering what the total count was. It's a lot. There wasn't quite 600. <coughs> Maybe five, about 550 between the three. <laughs> It was actually for an off election, like you say, it was pretty well attended, both right. not only here and Aurora, you know, Twinsburg too. They all the numbers were all pretty good for an off election. So. What do you think the longest line was in this building? It was just one men's room. Okay. There really was nothing. That's how it should be. We never had all eight places to go on okay. either side. Gotcha. Good. Okay. Table legislation will stay tabled. Legislation, uh, resolution 60, 2013, a resolution to accept the recommendation of Planning and Zoning Commission to approve the lighting plan for Liberty Legis Subdivision, phase one, two, second reading. 
And I don't, have any of you been in Liberty Ledges? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Not for a couple months. Have you noticed anything when you drive in there? No, I guess not. Like how recent have we had to have driven in there? Right. <laughs> how many in the past month? I haven't been in there. What, is there a Sam Alonzo printing on the street or something? No, <laughs> no. It says... Um, There's a mural. What does it say? Um, the best residence in Twinsburg. Get out of here. Really? That's what the sign says. <laughs> I'll go get my nine iron. So, <laughs> it is being taken care of. <laughs> Wait, who put it up? Ryan Holmes. Really? Uh-huh. It's a little sign on the wow. directly across from the model. It says, it says um, the wow. best residence in Twinsboro. That's swell. So, their answer was um, that it would... Their mistake, it was supposed to say the best residents in Twinsburg school system, which I really don't believe that. But no, I wouldn't either. They wait and see how long they could get away with it. So. Wow. When you talk to them, would you ask them to make a donation to the next level? They, uh, they, they aren't very receptive to anything. That's why I, I, I'm not a... I'm not going to buy a, a home in Liberty Lodges anytime soon. How's that? <laughs> I've had my share of go-arounds because one of the gentlemen said that I was sitting at home drinking beer, oh. laughing at him. So okay. it didn't go well. I'm past the comments. But you can be called on at any time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you read this, huh? <laughs> can we pick it? Go ahead. Oh, no, they're, 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 they'll fix it. They'll fix it. Well, Nothing else gets passed until it's microphone. can't get it. Well, you know, I told them from now on that they have to go to Twinsburg's planning and zoning if they want anything passed. So I'm sure it'll get fixed. <laughs> because since they're not in Reminderville, then that's where they need to go. But we get the tech. Okay. Well, wait, I got one other thing on uh, Liberty Ledges. I got it email from Terry today in regard to the street lighting because um, there is no lighting planned at the entrance and they're saying that there's a street light directly across the street if we're all okay with that otherwise we can ask for more lighting up front at the entrance I remember that came up when they were putting in the signs out front and we said well why aren't you putting any signs? they're not putting any lights on the signs well, I mean no his plan was they they should should cut. Cut. that's crazy light from that was Mario's plan. Yeah, and, and Mario responded to Terry today and said that there's a street light on the other right. side of the street, so I mean, they weren't planning on putting anything I in. I don't know if we can make them or not, but I mean, I would, I guess we were all, when we when we saw it, we were all kind of shocked too. We're like, well, why wouldn't you illuminate the signs? You know, they're nice signs, and, but the street light's doing that. What was the big deal with the Harrington lights in the beginning of that development? I don't remember. Do you remember Sam? Yeah. What did? It was he wanted to. He needed approval so he could get him in. He told so everybody. So he wanted was, to put him in. He wanted to get him put in okay. in a certain amount of time. So we rushed it through, got him the approval because he said the residents were complaining. And then it was like six or eight months later before he even got him in. Right. Right. But it was him who initiated. It. Okay. Yeah. That's all. I was. Yeah, speaking of which, how is that uh, patio? Coming at the back of, uh, they ru they wanted to rush that one through. The patio oh, at the back of. Uh, you know why? <laughs> Sorry. Just Did you know what their permits? They told them their permit fee was. Uh, Fifty five hundred dollars. Really? Bob moved the dust bowl over. <laughs> nice. <laughs> it's been so. Um, the other day when I was up there, I was talking to him about it, you know, and he goes, man, your permits are. It was $5,500. What are you talking about? So I came back down and asked Terry, and Terry come back. He goes, Bob moved a dust mall over. It should have been 550 bucks. <laughs> so there's a big difference between... Well, it just, it just reminded me, they were in a big hurry yeah. twice, actually, to get that thing. So now you know why. So now they'll, they'll think about it differently. <laughs> Third time's a charge. Yeah. Okay, Resolution 61 2013, a resolution authorizing and directed the police chief to file on behalf of the Village of Reminderville, Summit County Domestic Preparedness Steering Committee, Homeland Security Radio Grant application, declaring emergency. Move to suspend the rules to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Oh, I'm sorry. 
You ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah, roll call. Mr. Silverston? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yeah. Mr. DeCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Move to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. Silverston? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DeCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. A resolution, is six, a resolution 63 yeah. 2013, a resolution to support and accept the recommendation of Twinsburg Township Village of Minerville Jet Board in regards to the 2014 Jet Area <coughs> projects, including the proposed decision of funding, therefore. First reading. Resolution 64 2013, a resolution to authorize the direct village. Oh, that was. Could we, could we do 63 and 66 by emergency since we have everybody here? And let's just do it. I move to suspend the rules and this is resolution 63 2013 move to suspend the rules and pass by emergency second roll call mr walter yes mr de carlo yes mr king yes mr condict yes mr molina yes mr silverston yes move to pass by emergency second roll call Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Since you were so persuasive, yeah. <laughs> Mr. Kodnick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverston? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Resolution 64 2013, a resolution to authorize the direct village engineer to design and prepare construction documents for the Regatta Trail Waterline Replacement Project pursuant to the agreement with the City of Cleveland, Division of Water, and thereafter proceed with the bidding process. First reading. Resolution 65, a resolution to accept the resignation of Sean Solar from the Village of Minerville Fire Department, effective November 30th, 2013, declaring emergency. Move to suspend the rules to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. King? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverston? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Move to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverston? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DeCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Resolution 66 2013, a resolution to approve the recommendation of the Twinsburg Township Village of Reminderville Jed Board in regard to the 2014 Jed budget. Move to suspend the rules and pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverston? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Move to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. Silverston? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Old business. I have a question. I guess this would be for Deborah. Deborah, with this addition, amendment to the agenda, mm -hmm. will the, this agenda be corrected to reflect that amendment, or will it only appear in the minutes? It will be only in the minutes. Only, only in, in the minutes. minutes. <laughs> All right, thank you for this quick You're answer. Mr. <laughs> <laughs> Thought it did. No? I read it out. Did I read 62? I didn't think you did. You skipped oh. it. That's yeah. why I was confused. Yeah. Resolution 62 2013, a resolution authorizing to direct the mayor to enter into agreement with the Twin Keystone Water District, the district to amend the area subject to authority of the <coughs> district first reading. Do you guys want to pass this by emergency too? I just want I'm not to trying to be funny. I'm I just saying it's it. it's a, it's actually a benefit to us yeah. to get yeah, get it rid of it. Sir. Move to suspend the rules to pass by because session. you know something that I've already reviewed. I've discussed it at the last council meeting. Yeah, needs to get done. Okay. Who made the motion? I'm sorry. Mario made the motion. Had second it. Mm -hmm. Said. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverston? Yes. Move to pass by <coughs> emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. 
DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverstein? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Any old business? New business? New business. I'd like to make a motion to authorize Deborah to run an ad in both the Twinsburg and Aurora papers to advertise the council opening. Just a, just a bulletin and the advocate, right? What's that? Just a bulletin and the advocate, yes, right? Sir. Do we need to post that on the, on the website. door and everything, too? We'll post it on the website. Yes, I did. Oh, oh. Right. Yeah. Okay. Mr. King? I'm get better abstain on that. You should go with it. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverstein? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Yes. Move to adjourn. Second. Second. Roll call. Mr. Condit? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Silverstone? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. King? Yes. I just want to say the paperless word.